Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for clicking on this video and welcome to the 2024 Screen Actor Guild reaction video. We're going to be dealing with some bad lighting. Yeah, no, I always have the hard time with it. We're going to see if the mic with this little thing on top is better versus with the other one. I'm still kind of, you know... I feel like at times the mic sounded really good and at times it didn't, but we'll see. I just actually uploaded my prediction video earlier today because like as a fool, I don't know why I thought the, the, the award show was going to be tomorrow. Anyway, I was very late to the game. Um, we've already seen some winners here for television. I don't really cover television on here or like I do some stuff but, like as far as award shows, mainly just movie stuff. Uh, but yeah, we're just going to see what's going on. Um, I'm not really like like this year for me hasn't really been more like 2023 rather wasn't really like a big movie time deal for me i haven't really been super excited for a lot of the movies or whatnot it's actually one of my favorite award shows because it's short it's sweet it's fun um when they start drinking kind of like the globes these are just some of my favorites because they're just so much fun okay hold on let me try to mess with the lights a little bit yeah i really need to get back on watching succession i I'm still on season one. I haven't even finished it. This is way worse. This is way worse. I think I'm just going to turn it off and turn on the lights from the room. Um, I just hate watching television with the lights on. I mean, this this is not any better either. But um, if you know, you know I am terrible with lighting. I think it's going to be Colkin. He's been the one that's been winning these lately, right? First section? Or one of the section brothers. Oh, hopefully Pedro Pascal. Yeah, no. Yeah, no, I definitely fought within. Like, look, let me tell y'all something, y'all. When it comes to saying daddy to people, that's not me. Ew, that's always been an ick. Good for you if you do it, okay? It's just always been an ick. When I tell y'all that Pedro Pascal made that word come out of me without an ick, like one day I was just seeing his pictures, thirst trapping. I was there and I went, Oh, daddy, I said, oh, shit. I mean, look at him, y'all. But, of course, we know who the winner here is going to be. This has been a lock. If you choose it, I mean, if anybody else wins, I'm going to be fucking shocked, for starters. You better say it. Say her name. I'm yes. Yes. This has been her award, the whole award show season. Yeah, no. This whole train deal. She's going to get that Oscar. She's going to look so beautiful doing it. I love it. This is the one that I'm like, I don't know. I don't know. Is it going to be Ponchi Omari? Is it going to be Cillian Murphy? I, at the end, said Ponchi Omari. I feel like he's going to get this one. And I think maybe, uh, well, and then I think, not maybe, but then I think Cillian will get the Oscar. And or Cillian will get both. And or maybe Ponchi Omari will get, will get both. You know, you never know. You never know. I really hope this is big cool. I hope I got the audio from over there. Oh my god, guys. I don't think I had the microphone on. Okay, so Paji Amati just won. I honestly not Paji Amati. <laughs> Paji Amati did not win. Okay, that's what I had predicted. I had to take the thing off. I think my, my thing went out of juice. <laughs> So the audio is probably going to be worse now. Okay. I don't know. I don't know if y'all heard. Paji Omani did not win. Cillian Murphy won. Which I thought he was. He was my second choice. I quite honestly... Shush! Just these. Stop making fun of me. I honestly thought... Like, I, I was like... Cillian's going to win. 
actors. But at the same time, you know, because Jeez. like actors, other actors, I was like, they're probably gonna give it to Giamatti because Sydney's gonna get the big one. This is the Gladstone versus Stone Award, kind of like with Giamatti and Murphy. I do feel like Gladstone is a little bit on like the back burner. Not really that much of a race anymore, but you never know. You never know. I'm gonna still say it's gonna go to Emma Stone because I love Emma Stone. I love that performance. But. I told y'all, I told y'all, I'm still shocked. It's still shocked. Oh my God, this really brought her back into the Oscar race. I mean, I know you're, some of you are gonna be like, she never really left. She didn't really leave, but I feel like it was really more like, again, the Emma Stone like train. We were like, choo-choo, Emma Stone, yes, jump on board. But she said, nope, I'm glad she won. I'm glad she won. She did get a really good performance as well. This is gonna be either the cast of Oppenheimer or Barbie. Um, I did end up picking Oppenheimer. I just feel like that's gonna be the obvious, the obvious win there. But I wouldn't be mad if Barbie won. Yeah, look, my hair growth is coming through really nicely. I'm hoping, I'm really hoping that by May, because I really want to cut it in May. I'm hoping it's at least shoulder length and then I'm gonna cut my hair because I'm tired of my long hair y'all okay let's see here let's see here okay Oppenheimer yes of course it had to be Oppenheimer who else okay guys that is it for me tonight thank you so much for watching reactions this year were pretty like dull to be honest with you wasn't too much like big big i feel like other times i've been like more and more excited but there wasn't much much going on this year i wasn't losing my freaking mind job we're gonna be doing oscar predictions i'm gonna be doing those wait when are the oscars on the 10th right it's like is it that like two three weeks away maybe next week i'll do the predictions and i'm hoping maybe tomorrow i don't know i was gonna do it tomorrow to rank all 10 best picture nominees but i kind of really want to rewatch oppenheimer because <sighs> i really wasn't a fan of it the first time i watched it. maybe i just wasn't like like i don't know like it's a great movie like hear me out Shh. don't yell at me it's a great movie i can admit it's a great movie enjoyment wise it wasn't for me so <sighs> i kind of want to rewatch it to see uh, if Langley, upon rewatch I will enjoy it or get something else uh, from it you know I don't know so I feel like I should get props for that right I'm not just going in and being like no Oppenheimer number 10 no Oppenheimer's not number 10 by the way it's not it's another movie it's a movie I watched today did I tell you what I watched I didn't tell y'all but just I'll see you guys um in a week or so for predictions for best picture rankings for oscar um reaction video as well for i think that's it right yes those are the end of my award season and then i did mention in my last video that i'm gonna be doing like my top 100 board games i'm getting that list kind of like situated i'm almost done with it i think i pretty much have it like squared away so we'll be doing that and we'll be doing that like a little segment situation there and then i'm still working on my 100 best movies as well so that'll come later on uh but yeah that that's it for me don't forget to like comment subscribe share all that good stuff until next time i'll see you guys at concessions bye